you know, I just kind of figured it out for myself. What happened with me is when I was going through my divorce, somebody did some holotropic breath work with me and then uh, taught me some bastrika, which he called emergency breath work. If you don't have any time and you know, you've got a short amount of time, it takes about five minutes. It's the most powerful thing. He, he got it from the, the yoga sutras. And so I'll show you that afterwards. But from there, I just learned a little bit of breath of fire, a little bit of Wim Hof and then just did it. I figured, shit, it works. Yeah, So it's not that complicated. Let me do it. Yeah. How about doing it? That's my practice, mm -hmm. you know, instead of trying to give it some kind of nomenclature or right. something, you know. You can call it pranayama, you can call it Wim Hof, or you can call it shit on a stick. I don't care. Yeah. Let's breathe, mm -hmm. you know. I agree. So, uh, so I like to do, uh, we'll do 30 rounds in through the nose, out through the mouth. The exhale is pretty easy. Uh, it kind of does it by itself. You kind of just let go. I like to get my spine into it a little bit. And so uh, a good inhale uh, in through the nose and then just let it go out through the mouth. And so we'll do an exhale retention. I learned this from Chrome Gracie and his dad Hickson Gracie. They like to get all the gas out. So <laughs> gas gets trapped in their stale air. So You'd be surprised at how much you can keep blowing mm -hmm. and then hold that you got about 15 to 20 seconds on that I like to throw in the Taoist tummy massage because that uh, you know you got the vagus nerve coming down uh, through the heart into the gut and our emotions get trapped in there the second and third chakra our power and our sacral chakra so you can just get in with the nerve endings and I recommend you know going very gentle because because there's a lot of nerve endings there and there's a lot of tissue and organs so just all you really have to do if you haven't done it before it gets pretty sore pretty easily pretty quick so just touch it in there you can go around the belly button or in the four corners pancreas spleen liver underneath the ribs and then you've got descending colon on the left side, ascending colon on the right side, vagus nerve that comes through the heart, through all these nerve endings into your internal organs and goes around the belly button. For extra, wait till the gag reflex happens, then take that in and hold that for as long as you can. So exhale retention, inhale retention. And we'll do about 30, uh, 30 rounds, 30 breaths, and I'll call it. All right, you ready? All right, can I watch you first? Sure. Let me just do a couple so I can see what you're doing, then okay. I'll follow you. So when you say retention, are you, you're not holding it at all? Yeah, I'll call the retention. Oh. After 30 breaths, I'll say, okay, exhale everything out now. Uh -huh. Hold. And then wait till the reflex. Hold. Got it. And when you hold the, the inhale, you get a lot of compression in your in your shoulders and stuff. I like to use that to stretch out my lats and the, the bottom of the, the, the ribs. Yeah, exactly. You can use that compression to stretch out the That's neck. That's what sh shoes also call. So, yeah, so I can sit a little bit higher. Okay, so here we go. In through the nose, out through the mouth. Here we go. Out all the way. Empty the lungs. Hold. Eight. 
10 year old. In through the nose, out through the nose. Come back to center. Round one. Good work. Good work. Yeah. Right. Change it up a little bit. We're gonna do, uh, this time we're gonna do a breath of fire. Breathing in through the nose, out through the nose. Um, what I like to do is to turn the, uh, the neck, gets into the eustachian tubes. Oftentimes we get clogged sinuses from pollution and just, build up in the system so this opens up all the the lymph channels the lymph nodes and the, the, the yoga sutras talk about the nadis which are the small chakras all over our body the energy centers all over our body and we have a lot of them in our face so you can do the you can do the uh, Louis Armstrong trumpet <laughs> if you need to open them up a little bit more um, open up the, the nose channels a little bit more, you know, blow whatever hockey snot you gotta get out there, just get all that stuff out. And so turning the neck from side to side opens up the eustachian mm -hmm. tubes. In through the nose, so we're gonna do uh, in through the nose, out through the nose, about 30 to 50 breaths, and then again with the exhale retention and then the, the inhale retention. So you moving side to side or you're doing them all in one direction and then? like that you'll feel into it okay. so just open up those channels in the face all right here we go breath of fire All the way out. Hold. Inhale, hold. out through the nose. Hmm. Hmm. So we're gonna do one breath out, lion's breath out with the tongue. Again, get, getting all that stale air out, so empty. And then come up and we're gonna do strong breaths in through the nose, even if you got snot or stagnation or deviated septums, just breathe through it, breathe through it. And so your diaphragm's open, your shoulders are dropped, then you're going to hold it on the 21st breath. So we're gonna do about 20 breaths and then hold it on the 20th breath. Be careful with the compression and how much you hold it because the DMT, you can squeeze the perineum, the, the taint, Squeeze the perineum and, and that'll bring the Kundalini up into your third eye and it can activate the DMT, so, so, so watch it. You know, watch the compression. Um, you know, cause you know, people at home might, you know, you don't want to pass out, so be gentle with yourself. So, so lion's breath out, 20 breaths, we'll hold it on the 21st. Squeeze the perineum underneath your, your in between your, your, your balls and your anus and then, uh, Drop the shoulders, open up the diaphragm, and just go into that meditative state. I'll do one round. Okay. I 
just went on that one. You gotta be careful. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so just be careful with the compression. Mm -hmm. And so, so you got that lion's breath out, and then we'll do two lion breath, and then one breathe. one lion okay. breath. And then you held it with the breath in that time. Yeah, hold the breath in. It's it's an in, in, inhale retention. Got it. Right, lion's breath out. 20 breaths, hold on the 21st, inhale retention. Squeeze the perineum and don't pass out. All right. <laughs> Got it. <laughs> All right, here we go. Here we go. Good man, that's great. Yeah, so that that's best streaka. That's emergency breath work. You got no time. Somebody's going into a panic attack, or you just do three rounds of that. That'll that'll take you to where you want to be. Thank you, Troy. <laughs> you look like a white yogi with that beard <laughs> and the and the brown skin, man. Yeah, yeah. This, the sun is good food. Yeah. As long as you got good food in you to protect you against the sun. Amazing. Cool. I'll be doing this every day.